Right, this, this video is a how not to do it. And it's a Houston, we have a problem. And what the problem is, when we've mixed up this batch of uh, epoxy, it mustn't have had enough hardener in it. it. It hasn't gone off. The rest is like a rock. This one here, it, it's still ooey and gooey. So it's, it's clogged our file up. Uh, there's a couple of techniques you can use. See, it, it's pulling out there. Uh, if it won't and it's real sticky, then get some acetone or metho on it, that'll lift it out. Just wire brush it and make sure when you do that um, you don't use a wire brush that's had oil or grease on it or been playing around with cars because you put the, do that, put the oil and grease onto there or contamination onto there, you're then going to put that contamination onto there. So you've got to be careful when you do things like this. Um, this file card for example, uh, this is what I should use on the file, they're specially made for it, and this one you can see she's had a rugged life. But see it's all covered with oil and stuff, I, I won't use that on this file because there's a chance I'll get oil on there, and that'll end up on there, so be very careful. So what I did was I uh, just got the knife in, dug it out, and we'll have to do it out the other side too because it's going on through, and then just cut it away and peel it out and just take it out and then we'll have to redo that that section so be very careful when you're mixing um, I got a little lazy yesterday and uh, I overfilled the resin and I should have been more careful when I tipped the measure cup back to line it up to make sure I had the right ratio of hardener I mustn't have done that and we've ended up with not enough hardener in there so always be very careful when you mix the boat coat's quite tolerant but don't stretch the friendship, or well, that's what will happen.